This is Ahmadi, a mother at an SOS children's village in Faridabad. She's responsible for 12 children. Ahmadi was already able to look after Rani as an infant and integrate her with the other children in her family. This is where Rani has been living for three years now. Together with her siblings and her SOS mother, she does her share of the household chores and lends a helping hand. But it's not just household chores that are shared. The younger ones also benefit from the older children during homework and playtime, and vice versa. Mothers at SOS children's villages take charge of bringing up and looking after the children placed in their care. They establish a personal bond with the children and actively support their development. With over 10 children in the home, it's not always easy. It means that Rani can go to kindergarten carefree and unburdened and there discover her first skills. The SOS Children's Village has created a happy and harmonious atmosphere so that these little ones have a big opportunity in life and never again forget how to laugh. It makes me very happy to see Rani because my dream has always been to give a child the best upbringing so that one day she can live her own life, standing on her own two feet. Here children can still be children. The SOS Children's Village gives orphaned and abandoned children a family environment that protects them and allows them to grow up with support and encouragement. 50 children between the ages of 1 and 18 are looked after in Faridabad, one of the three SOS Children's Villages around Delhi. Thanks to individual support and education, children and teenagers are given a future, so they in turn can become self-sufficient members of society.